All right, ready? You guys know audience etiquette, no talking please, no doing homework. All right, go ahead, Agent Jeff, whenever you're ready. Should go mad. People have to know whether they're coming or not, and they accept and regret and regret and accept it. They, they drive me wild. This is my last dinner party, my very last. A fiasco, an another fiasco. A half a crowd here together, when I had uh, planned everything so beautifully. Now, how shall I sit them? How shall I sit them? If I want Mr. Mr. Tabby and Mrs. Conley there, then Mrs. Tabby has to sit next to her husband. And if I want Mr. Morgan there, oh, it's impossible. I, I, I might as well put the names in her head and draw them out of random. Never again. I'm through. Through with society, with, with parties, with friends. I wipe my slate clean. They'll, they'll miss my entertainments. They'll, they'll wish they had been more considerate. After this, I'm going to be selfish and, and hard and unsociable and drink my liquor myself and set an opera in gratis the whole time. And I'm through, through with men like Oliver Pransford. Oliver Pransford? I don't care how rich they are, how important they are, how influential they are. They are nothing without courtesy and consideration. Business, of and trade, Nonsense. Uh, oh. Did you want to come? Did you want to meet a suit for the girl? Did you want to marry her? Well, guess what? He's not good enough for you. Don't you marry him, though. Don't you dare marry him. I won't let you marry him. Do you hear? If you try to yell up or anything like that, I'll break it off. Yes? <coughs> Under the transport, we will never get recognition for me. I hate Oliver Transport. Yes.